think for the last few, I'm just going to give you some hints on how to do them. That geometric series, um, first term of five and a common ratio of three. Well, the nth term is a times r to the n minus one, m minus one, because you've got an m here. So we've got five times by three to the power of m minus one, and that equals that big number there. And so we've got to just rearrange this equation to solve it. Um, step one, let's divide both sides by five. And that would give you what m3 to the power of m minus one is. And then you could take logs from that. I mean, log base three of that, and then take away one. So there's a hint for that one. I think I'll do them all on the same recording. Um, here's question eight. Question eight, just go back to something you know when you've got these things here. We know that log to the base two of eight is three. So you can rearrange that to say that two to the power of three is eight. Let's see how that links with our one here. Instead of a two, we've got a five. So it's five to the power of four. Five to the power of four is 125 X. Well, five to the power of four, I think is 625. And you can work out what x is from that one. Um, let's have a look at 9 as well. Um, I'll do that in another video.